welcome to wrestling welcome to our survivor series pay-per-view predictions it's all about that thing there the pay-per-view prediction championship it's Adam so close the champion but yeah it's so far away you've won the last two how I've do you feel about two. that um, well actually i feel quite glad i feel quite proud of myself that i'm the longest ever reigning pay-per-view prediction champion I feel good that I'll, I'll be totally honest, I'm not confident I can get it off you. Well, you want to touch it, I only, you? you want to touch it, but you The can. only thing is, I tend to do well in the big four pay-per-views. You do, actually. I but, do shit at all the other ones. Yeah. But I'm not confident. I'm not confident. Anyway, let's get into it. Now, we're going to do this slightly different. Um, Before obviously, we start, oh, go on, go on. What do you think the main event will be? Ooh. I think it'll be women's. Nah, I'm going with men's. Don't know. Don't know actually. Never even thought no. about that. Um so it's gonna be it's a little bit different because it's Survivor series. We're mixing it up a bit. Obviously the one on one matches we just pick who's gonna win. Uh but for the elimination traditional tag elimination whatever yeah. they call it we've got the tag team the women's and the men's sort of tag matches where five on five where there are three points available we are going yes. to pick the winner of the match for one point and the last remaining member of the smackdown and raw team so that's worth a point each so yeah so basically just to make that clear we're picking team raw or team smackdown for the win yeah uh, but then we're picking the two team, or we are picking two teams that will be yeah two members in the last two, yeah uh, two members of the team. So the obviously on the losing team, they've got to be the last person sort of in that team. Yeah. Whereas if there's like say there's three people left on the winning, on the winning team, team and they're one got, of them still, yeah. that is also worth another point. It makes sense. So in their matches, there is nine points available, which is so. Bit crazy, really. Apparently, the tag elimination match is on the pre-show. Yes. We're going to include it. Yes. Um. So, <laughs> Christ, it's a good job we got the laptop here. <laughs> <laughs> um. Team Team Raw featuring Bobby Roode, Chad Gable, uh, the Revival, B Team, Lucha House Party, not Lucha Underground. <laughs> as I said in the video. Uh, yeah, and it says they're and or Grand Meta League, so obviously they're not. Yeah, the and uh, the Ascension, Ascension, which we I don't think we we this we said about that in the last video. Uh, Team SmackDown is the Usos, New Day, Sanity, Luke uh, Luke Gallows and Carl Anderson and the Colognes. I think after just reading <laughs> the teams out, I've already I've made my yeah. pick. SmackDown. Team SmackDown. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> They've got so many better. Yeah tag teams then raw and i think as well what, what the way that they'll play it off is like because uh, you've got what well, you've got bobby Roode, chad gable are, are relatively new is it it's an elimination one yeah and is it say bobby Roode gets pinned that's them out i'm assuming so yeah so i'm assuming they're not going to do 10 pins on no 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 i'm assuming minute. it'll be it'll, the rule will be if your team gets picked, yeah you're, you're out, out. Yeah. right right um so i'll let you go first yeah so we've both picked team smackdown for the the overall shall one. i record this down yes please uh, we, we never remember not what what remember i am going to open an ink pad up <laughs> uh, so i think that um, team tag raw elimination will a uh, surviving member, so last team, will be the Revival. Oh, you're going to be outside the box. Well, is it outside the box? It's going to be them or Bobby Roode and Chad Gable, isn't it? Yeah, so you've gone for the Revival. Oh, it might be the B team, though. B team, B team. <laughs> oh. No, I'm going to Revival. Because they should be. They should get a good showing. And I'm going to pick... Uh, my remaining SmackDown members as Ooh, it's, between, it's, it's between two for me. Yeah, it's a tough one, but they might they might go outside the box with sanity. Yeah, mm. I think the only bit for me is it depends 
on, on who's picked for what team. I think if Killian is in Sanity, I think they remain. But I think if not, they might get eliminated. I'm going to pick Sanity. Oh, I'm yeah. going to go outside the box and I'm going to pick Sanity. They're going to get a good showing. Because they've had nothing since they've been put They have literally have nothing and not been on many of the shows really. I think the, 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 they'll go Sanity and it'll, and it'll kick start no. their career. Well, <laughs> roster. your champ. The champ. <laughs> the champ is also picking a Smackdown for the W. Yeah. And I am going with Bobbington Rude and Chad Gabello to remain for yeah. Raw. Fair pick. And I am going for the Usos for SmackDown. I think I'm playing it kind of safe. I nearly this picked one. them as well. I think with them being captains, they will hang on in there. Yeah. Okay. Cruiserweight Championship Buddy Murphy versus Mustafa Ali. I think we're probably going to say the th- same thing. Yeah. One, two, three. Buddy Murphy. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, he obviously got it at uh, Crown Jewel. It's not been that long. He's not going to lose it already, surely yeah, he's not. He's not going to lose it. No. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, what should we go next? Let's go for a standard... Number yeah, number six on the list. The AOP for Raw versus The Bar. Um, this is going to be interesting because AOP have Drake Maverick. Uh, I was going to say, actually, before this match, I think there's going to be a, a funny segment. Drake Maverick's going through something. Drake Maverick and the big show because yeah. they're both going to be. Yeah, because, also, because how, how, tiny is how small <laughs> is Drake Maverick? <laughs> tiny next Have you seen, by the way, I meant to mention this the week, right? When he comes in with the AOP, like yeah. you just said, he's tiny next to them. You know, like he, hold, he holds, they all hold their hand, yeah. hands up and that. He can't reach, he's got to do it by their elbow and go like that because he can't reach, he's really funny. But yeah, th- th- this will happen. Yeah. Okay, and, and it will look hilarious. Yeah. And I think Big Show's probably going to kill him. Yeah. And then um, the AOP will go mental. Yeah. Um, and I wonder if. Who are you Ooh, going I don't want to pick? Shall I go first this time? Go on then. I am going with the bar. So I was going to say that I think that, that Drake will get killed. AOP will go mad. Mm. Um, and the bar will win off a distraction. Mm, maybe. Off that distraction. I think AOP need the win more. But I think the bar will Yeah. Win. I don't know. We've picked, massive for AOP. we've picked two Smackdown. Oh, shit, yeah. We've, we've got to remember this. Mm. But. It, right, I want to go different. I want to go AOP then. Mm. <laughs> But it does link in with my future predictions, so that's fine for me. Okay. Right. Uh, let's do. Let's do number one. Number one. Ronda Rousey versus Charlotte Flair. I don't know what to pick now because of what's happened. I am going with. Rousey. Oh yeah. 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 I was gonna go with Becky, but I think the chair. I think because, because now it isn't champion versus champion, they'll just stick with the champion. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah. So Ronda Rousey for both of us. Um. Oh, you've gone for Ronda Rousey. Can't into that. What <laughs> going on? Ronda Rousey. Uh, next up is we're gonna go with the ladies. Team Raw is. Mickey, Naya, Tamina, Natalia. When did she get put in? Yeah, she got put in. When? Um, literally before they announced. Um, I didn't know that because I thought it was a full team of heels. No, she said, that, "Oh, and Natalia couldn't be down there um, before, so Natalia is on the team." Right versus Team SmackDown: Carmella, Naomi, Sonya Deville, Asuka. And TBA. Yeah, we don't know who that is because Charlotte has been replaced and it never got announced, so who is it? Lana. Lana is the best. It probably will be Lana. Lana number one. 
unless they're going to bring like do a big call up from NXT like Kyrie mm. Sane maybe. Mm. No, it'll be Lana. <laughs> I think it'll be Lana. Mm. Possibly. Anyway, I am going with. To remember, Raw. You need to, yeah, you need to pick. I was going to say, uh, you need to pick the team and your survivors. Uh, yeah, Team Raw because SmackDown got the jump on yeah. Raw. So normally that leads to the other team winning. Plus, Raw is full of big baddies. Yeah, and my first pick is the team of Nia Jax and Tamina to remain because if Raw are going to well, win. Well, you've got to pick one of them. Well, Nia. You're going to pick Nia? Yeah. Well, Nia and Tamina are in the. They're the team, aren't they? Oh no, I'm sorry. Yeah, it's not a team. No, I keep thinking all the time. Yeah, yeah uh, no, I'm going with Nia because if Raw are going to win, she's not going to get pinned, I don't think. She's going to be like the the remaining. And your SmackDown lady. Yeah. And my SmackDown woman, there can only be one. <laughs> I know what you're going to say. Asuka. Yeah, I knew you were going to say Asuka. Asuka! Um, who are you going with? Yeah. Currently, uh, currently. So I'm with Team Raw. We have it as one. I've gone. I'm on two Raw currently, and you are on one SmackDown, one Raw, two Raw, two Raw, one SmackDown. Yeah, uh, so I'm going Team Raw for the ladies, and I think I'm going to pick. Um, uh, I think Naya is the obvious choice. Mm. Well, uh, for me, it was between Naya and, and Tamina. Tamina. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so I can't see either of them getting pinned or oh, beaten. So. so I'll pick Tamina, but I think we might both get a point anyway. Yeah, there. I think um, them two will remain. Yeah. Uh, Smackdown. A Smackdown lady to remain. Ooh. It's a difficult one, isn't it? Because they've got to. They've got to. I, I suppose it has to be Asuka, really, looking at that. I mean, Naomi's the only other one you well, could put in there. but You would have gone, I presume we both would have probably gone for Charlotte if she was in it, but mm. she's not anymore, so. It's, it's going to be Asuka or Naomi. Uh, I'll, I'll go with Asuka as well. It's the obvious choice. Okay, moving on, we will go with Seth Rollins versus Shinsuke Nakamura. I'm going to go a bit left field with this one. Oh, uh, yeah? I think Nakamura's going to win. Oh, he's putting it out there. Yeah, he's had nothing for like two months. And. I think that Dean Ambrose is going to yeah. cause yeah. some trouble. So I'm going Shinsuke Nakamura. I am also going Nakamura, mainly for the fact that Dean is going to get involved, I think. And I've gone quite a raw heavy on the wins, so I don't think they're going to... It wouldn't be like a massive whitewash, so I think SmackDown will get this Raw's won the last two years overall, hasn't it? Yeah. But with Shane stealing that, um, sort of stealing the World Cup, I think Raw will win this as like revenge. Yeah. Right, let's do the... I'm assuming it's going to be one of the uh, traditional matches to close the show. I think it's been the men's, usually is. normally is the men's. So we'll do Brock Lesnar versus Daniel Bryan. Uh, so Daniel Bryan obviously just won the championship. Yeah. Um, tough one. Tough one to pick. Um, I should know by now what never to go against Brock, and Brock will win. <laughs> yeah, it's not a bad rule to go by, is it? Just never go against Brock because unless he's fighting Roman Reigns, he's gonna win. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. I don't know what to pick. I really don't. I'm, do you know what? I'm going to stick with you just to keep me within the channel. <laughs> <laughs> I want to go with Brock as well, but I don't know what they'll do here. No. I honestly don't. Uh, okay.
Okay, closing Lee, was it just the men's? Yeah, the men's traditional match uh, is Team Raw, Dolph Ziggler, Drew McIntyre, Braun Strowman, Finn Balor, Bobby Lashley, with Baron Corbin and Leo Rush apparently, uh, versus Team SmackDown, The Miz, Shane McMahon, Rey Mysterio, I forgot Shane McMahon was in the team, oh, Samoa God. Joe, Jeff Hardy, right, instantly Baron Corbin's going to be ringside, Braun Strowman's going to go after him. Yep, and I have changed my prediction. You know who I'm going with? I'm going with Raw, by the way. Right. I'm going with Raw, and I'm going for Drew as the last man standing. Okay. And what about your Smackdown last man? Smackdown last man. He... <laughs> you know who I'm going with? I think I might as well. I'm going with Shane. <laughs> it shouldn't be. It should not be. I think... But it's gonna be. It's gonna be. Yeah. He's the best wrestler in the world. <laughs> wasn't he? Wasn't he the last man last year? Yeah. The Triple H. Yeah, and they did the yeah. Ooh. I think that Team Raw's gonna have too much infighting. Mm, possibly. And I think Team SmackDown are gonna win. Yeah, maybe Drew will go after Finn. Strowman will go after thing A. Mm, possibly. Uh, uh, I'm gonna have a team SmackDown for the win. I'm gonna go I'm gonna go Samoa Joe. Yeah. What's as the last man standing? Men's raw. And I'm gonna go with It's hard to see past Braun Strowman yeah. in any situation. But I think there's gonna be a big curveball with him. So, I'll go Drew as well. Double Drew what? No, we've both gone Raw. We have both gone Raw. Yeah, we've, we've both gone Raw. Alright, Raw for a third year in a row. Mm. Okay, that is our pay view predictions for Survivor Series. And uh, we'll be sure to be doing a post uh, mortem video for this pay per view. So make sure to subscribe and you will get to play okay. before we go. Well, what do you think will be match of the night? Because I reckon that Rollins versus Nakamura has potential to be a match of it the does, night. It does, yeah, it certainly does. Um, you would hope Danny Bryan can get a good match out of Brock, mm. but you never know with Brock's matches. Yeah, that's it. Um, the bar are good workers. And obviously the men's, well, all the, um, all the sort of, the Raw and SmackDown women's men's traditional oh there's me now traditional matches are always good yeah I don't know I don't so know really I've the only match I'm not looking seen. forward to is the tag match on the pre-show because if it's anything like last no, year yeah. it was absolute chaos Ron too many people Ron to Charlotte could be great could be we'll see anyway yeah. we'll see you in our pay-per-view post-mortem video where we will have the winner where will it be? The trophy. Which side of the oh, table oh, will it be oh, on? Oh, oh. See you then.